Welcome back to my channel on linguistics and language learning. What words come into your mind when you're exposed to the term three diagram? Difficult, complicated, confusing? I believe after watching this video, you find it easy to analyze a sentence using it three times. Here you are. I offer five steps to analyze a sentence using a three time. First, divide a sentence into noun phrase and verb phrase, or NP and FIP. All of the three time crimes begin with classification or definition of a sentence into NP and FIP. Second, define the PS rules. Define the phrase structure rules. And you see that each of the phrases has its own PS rules. And you have to know exactly the PS rules of each of the phrases. Third, define the number of branches based on the PS rules. The branch, the number of branches depends on the PS rules. In other words, you may have only one branch, you may have two branches, three branches, four branches, or even five branches. It depends on the applicable PS rules. Fourth, stop drawing the branches when P has been eliminated. What is P? P stands for phrase. It means that you have to eliminate all P here before you stop drawing the branches. As long as the letter P still exists in the diagram, you have to draw the branches of that P. But when P has been eliminated, Okay, you see article, noun, preposition, adjective, noun, and then you can stop drawing the branches. Finally, label the elements with the given words. It depends on the words you analyze. I think that's all. The easy five steps are to draw a two diagram in sentence nice. See you in the next video.